my new exhaust system for my MR2. So you can see on the MR2, it's starting to rust out right there. This is an HKS system on it, but this was on it when I bought the car. And I've had the car for more than 20 years now. So I don't know when this was installed on it, but time for a swap. So I didn't want to put just regular mufflers on it and have them welded in and whatnot. So I was able to find this and order this from Japan. So let's open it up and see what we got. So pull the bubble wrap off of it. Uh, looks pretty good. Interesting, and this is a single box design where the HKS one had two smaller pieces with the tube connecting them. So, all right. Trick will be getting the old one off. So on my MR2, there's a connection point right here. So my headers are here, right here, leading in to collection tube. And this is just a short little pipe. The cat is right here. So if I take this connection off, I can take the whole muffler and cat down at the same time. So that's the plan. So let's see. There's a little... It looks like that was supposed to be tacked on right there, but it is not holding. So let's see. Oh, guess what? <laughs> that one came right loose. Oh. I sprayed these the other day with a little lubricant. I need to get an extension for that one there. So I would normally use my power tools to get this off, but I can't make too much noise because my wife is a nurse and she worked last night. So. This one doesn't make too much noise, and guess what? Bolt came right out. So, a little rusty on the end that was exposed, but the threads, the threads look great. So, wow. <laughs> that, that couldn't have been easier. I was not sure, because I've stories from people trying to do this so well there we go this whole thing this whole thing is now hanging just in the rubber hangers so let's take a look at what I've got there so I know that there's one right up here from this rod and there too so hard to see it but let's see if I can just pop those off and take this down in one sweet move okay so got the entire muffler off so the two brackets I wanted to show with it was up there it was really hard to see so there's a bracket and there's a bracket and these two pieces here it is without it nice and open now so so these two pieces, so here's here's the one hanger where it goes right there. I sprayed some lube in there to slide better. And then here's the other side right there. So slide the new one back in place. And then here's where we bolt up to. So take a wire brush to that, clean that up. And uh, we'll be good to go. Almost ready to put this bad boy in.
works. This is really cool. They cut their logo into this test pipe. That's totally cool. Only on one side. <laughs> but, so I did notice when I took this off, though, I can hear noise inside the cat or it's falling apart. So it was no good anyway. So probably a good thing that it's, this is being done. Well, I've got the new muffler in the hangers and it just will rotate a little bit like that to fit up there. So it should look pretty amazing. So, and the interesting part that I had happen is so this test pipe is actually a little shorter than the cat that's in there right now. And then if I come up here, so from there to there, if I put this on and hold that up, you can see it's too short. It doesn't fit. So this test pipe that I got said it fit and replaced that catalytic converter right there. So something's amiss. So I need to take either measure and take that piece right there down to the to a mobile shop and have them extend it or just drive the car down and have them put in a piece that will go from there to there. And I notice, you probably can't tell when I rotate this up to how it'll sit, um, there's a little, a little bend in the pipe and that test pipe I have is a straight pipe. So, I'm thinking that maybe I'll take it down and have them do it so they can put a little bend in it and make it fit perfect. So, so we shall see. I'll get that done soon. Okay, final installation. The new muffler is installed on the MR2. The, here's the test pipe. This is what I ordered, but it was the wrong size because it was designed to be for stock. And mine has the TRD headers on it and it had an HKS exhaust, um, which they don't make anymore. So I had to do this one instead, but I had a muffler shop do the flanges from the test pipe onto a flex pipe and just measured it. So cut out some gaskets for it. And um, cause this end was bigger. So, <clears throat> but it is up and on and we shall see how it starts here in a minute or sounds, I guess. <laughs> 